All right, we're going to take a look at some news headlines. Are you ready? <clears throat> uh, recent news broke that Mel Gibson has been cast in the John Wick prequel series, The Continental. Uh, no word yet, though, if any roles have been offered to Kevin Spacey or Jesse Smollett, or if we can expect any episodes to be directed by Brian Singer or Roman Polanski. <laughs> It's an all-star crew they're going to put together there. Don't you mean Juicy Schmolet? <laughs> <laughs> From Dave Chappelle. Oh. Uh. Watched Venom 2, starring Tom Hardy and Woody Harrelson. Uh, Woody Harrelson plays this basically a big red Venom. Carnage. And he also, yes, his name's Carnage. And he also has a red, well, he has red hair. And John Travolta called, and he wants his wig back. <laughs> Oh, I get a little sensitive so about hair I'm jokes. not good at this. I'm not little, good at this. A little sensitive with hair jokes. <laughs> <laughs> You're sensitive. Why do you think I'm always wearing ads? <laughs> Dune has finally been released, and fans are pretty split. It's a pretty polarizing mix here yeah. uh, on the feedback for the film. And a lot of people are pretty upset with the name Duncan Idaho not fitting in with the sci-fi realm. However, those same fans are fine in the universe with Qui-Gon Jinn, Obi-Wan Kenobi, Anakin Skywalker, and Padme Amidala naming their children Luke and Leia. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just had to That's point a very that good out. Point. That's a very good it's point. a movie, people. Relax. <laughs> Jeez, there's giant sandworms. You're going to be upset over a name. <laughs> giant sandworms. Okay. Okay, so there is still anger over Dave Chappelle's latest comedy special the closer because of some of the jokes that he made and comments that he made about the transgender community well the netflix ceo backed dave chappelle because it was a comedy show it's his art and so on right but people are still upset about this like really upset about it even workers are trying to leave netflix because of this but cuties made it through because apparently sexualizing children is fine, but don't make fun of the transgender community or else you're going to hell. <laughs> What's the bar at, Netflix? Yes. Uh, <laughs> I should, uh, yeah, that's, that's pretty terrible that that was okay. Yeah. News broke recently that uh, the Halloween sequel, Halloween Ends, is going to take place four years after the Halloween Kills movie that was just recently released. There's going to be a time jump of four years. Uh, and apparently this time lapse is due to the 65-year-old Michael Myers being trapped in a vicious cycle of having to go to the bathroom, forgetting who he's meant to kill and where he left his knife. <laughs> <laughs> like seriously, when's this guy? This guy's gonna die of old age. Yeah. Like, he's 65 years old. <laughs>